we welcome you all in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thanks be to God for this blessed day in each one of our lives. I'm here standing in front of Pastor Nehemiah's house. We thank God for this beautiful house of Pastor Nehemiah in Antarvedi Palem, East Godavari District, Andhra Pradesh, India. Today is 17th December 2016. Thanks be to God for this beautiful village. Buffaloes are there, small hut is there. Praise be to God. Let us pray together to receive the blessings from the throne of grace. Father, we come to you through the blood of Jesus to thank you for this blessed time. Thank you, Father, for your love. Thank you, Jesus, for your grace. Thank you, dear Holy Spirit of God, for your help and guidance. We thank you for this blessed day in each one of our lives. We thank you, Jesus, for your death and your resurrection in each one of our lives. We thank you, Jesus, for your grace. We thank you for the gift of salvation. We thank you for the gift of love. We thank you for the gift of life. We thank you for what you have done in each one of our lives. We are the new creation in Jesus. We are the ambassadors for Christ Jesus. We are the salt and light of the world. We thank you for this blessed country, India. We thank you for President, Prime Minister, Government authorities and the people of India. We bless them with the word of salvation. We thank you, Jesus, for what you have done in each one of our lives. We thank you for all the unbelievers in every country. We thank you for all the continents. We bless them with the word of salvation. We thank you for every church, every saint and every servant of God. We bless them in the name of Jesus. Thank you, dear Holy Spirit of God, for opening our spiritual eyes to know more about Jesus and to become like Christ. We love you. We bless you. We give you thanks. In Jesus' name, we all agree and we pray. Amen. Praise be to God for this beautiful uh, village. I'm here in the village, my dear chosen children of God. Lord Jesus loves you. We love you. We are here to bless you all. Uh, my dear chosen children of God, this is the month of December. December is known as uh, month of miracles. I have a prophetic word for you. Dear chosen children of God, Lord Jesus says in the book of Joshua, chapter 1, verse 9, I am with you in all your ways. Wherever you go, Lord Jesus is going to be with you. God's presence is going to come with you and I. The book of Exodus, chapter 33, verse 14, he said, to Moses, my presence shall go with thee. Praise be to God. This is the dry grass. This grass came out of a paddy field. After removing the rice grains, they separated this grass. And they use it for buffaloes, cows here in the villages. Thanks be to God for his grace upon each one of our lives. My dear chosen children of God, Jesus loves you. In the book of Matthew chapter 1, verses 18 till 22, and the book of Matthew chapter 2, verses 1 to 10, and the book of Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 14, we shall know about the birth of Lord Jesus Christ. My dear chosen children of God, Lord Jesus was born in the village called Bethlehem in Nazareth in Israel. Why Lord Jesus was born into this world? Why did Jesus Christ of Nazareth come into this world? My dear chosen children of God, sin separated man from God. Sin brought sickness, sin brought curses, Sin brought every pain, every suffering, every kind of suffering into this world. Sin is the root of all evil. Sin is the reason for all suffering that mankind faces today. But thanks be to God for his grace upon each one of our lives. My dear chosen children of God, Lord Jesus loves you. We love you. 
we are here to bless you all praise be to god the wages of sin is death lord jesus christ was born into this world to remove the sin permanently praise be to god lord had chosen the nation called israel and the all the israelites for his kingdom to be established for his glory to be manifested my dear chosen children of god whoever may be you are wherever may be you are today you shall receive your miracle because lord jesus loves you all spirit of the lord wants to use you for his kingdom my dear chosen children of god john the gospel chapter 16 Verse thirty-three. Lord Jesus says, "In me, you shall find peace. In the world, pain, tribulation, persecution is there, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. Thanks be to God for His grace and the power and the anointing from Lord Jesus Christ, my dear chosen children of God. When Lord Jesus was born in Bethlehem." In the book of Matthew, chapter two, verses one to twelve, when you read, the wise men started following Lord Jesus' birthplace, where he was, and the star in the sky from east led them. These wise men came from east, as started following. the star to see baby jesus and to worship him king herod had come to know that the wise man had come to see the king of jews who was born in bethlehem he didn't know where he was born so he was asking the wise man where is the king of jews the wise man said we are following the star praise be to god Herod represents the world. Herod represents sin. Herod represents Satan. Herod represents uh, corruption. Herod represents world, my dear children of God. Herod talked to them with sweetness of lips, but his heart is full of corruption, full of wickedness. He was afraid of the king of Jews, my dear children of God. Jesus loves you. Thanks be to God for the star which guided these wise men. Star represents the Holy Spirit. When they had come to the Bethlehem and saw baby Jesus, there was a great joy in their lives, and they bowed down to baby Jesus. They opened their gifts and they presented gold. frankincense frankincense and myrrh gold represents purity holiness authority power and the kingship today lord is looking for holiness jesus is the holy god jesus is the way truth and life my dear children of god why did jesus come into this world to make sin a holy jesus christ of nazareth came into this world to make sin a holy to take you and I to be with him in heaven Jesus Christ of Nazareth is coming again into this world second time to take the church to be with him praise be to god my dear children of god Jesus Christ loves you so much John 3:16 for god so loved the world so he gave his only begotten son whosoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life praise be to god jesus loves you jesus christ of nazareth came into this world and he died on the cross and rose again after 3 days jesus is the son of god jesus is god john 14 verse 6 lord jesus said i am the way truth and life praise be to god whoever may be you are wherever may be you are jesus loves you the wise man gave second gift called frankincense frankincense is found from the tree in israel and in africa frankincense comes out of a tree 
and leaves and flowers they remove the they make the tree and the leaves and the flowers powder and they make this powder into a small uh, solid form stones dry them and uh, these uh, stones they keep on the fire and there will be smell sweet aroma praise be to god my dear chosen children of god today is the day of your miracle lord jesus loves you we love you we are here to bless you all frankincense represents sacrifice frankincense represents uh, love frankincense represents uh, humility frankincense represents uh, light jesus sacrificed his life lord jesus humbled himself unto the death lord jesus showed his love on the cross of calvary for the mankind he forgave everyone who kill him who trouble him who spat on his face lord jesus christ is the light of the world third gift the wise man brought uh, mer mer is the gum of a tree which is found in israel and in africa my dear chosen children of god jesus loves you we love you we are here to bless you all mer represents the death of jesus resurrection of jesus and the holy spirit of jesus Holy Spirit of God, praise be to God. Whoever may be you are, wherever may be you are, Spirit of the Lord wants you and I to come to His presence to receive the miracle today. John 4, verse 23 and 24. Help us to know, God is a spirit. Everyone who worships God should worship Him in spirit and truth. Praise be to God. Jesus loves you. We love you. Spirit of the Lord wants you and I to be holy because God is holy. The book of Matthew chapter 5 verse 8. Blessed are those whose hearts are pure. They shall see God. Jesus loves you. We love you. You shall see the miracles in your life because Jesus Christ of Nazareth is coming again into this world second time. Believe in Jesus. Repent for your sins and return to Lord Jesus. We are here to bless you all. Praise be to God for this blessed house, Pastor Nehemiah Garu's house. We have a beautiful birds here in this house. And I want you to see these love birds and this anointed servant of God, IPC Church Pastor, Indian Pentecostal Church. Here, these are the love birds that the pastor is looking after. Praise be to God for these love birds. Lord is good. We are here to bless you all. Jesus loves you. Whoever maybe you are, wherever maybe you are, believe in Jesus, repent for your sins, and receive your miracles. My dear chosen children of God, I'm here to bless you all. Let us pray together to receive the miracles together. Believe in Jesus to receive the miracle. Jesus loves you. Spirit of the Lord wants to use you for his kingdom. Let us pray. Repeat this prayer with me, my dear children of God. Father, we come to you through the blood of Jesus to thank you for this blessed time. Say after me, thank you, dear Holy Spirit, for your help and guidance. I believe in my heart that Jesus died for me on the cross. Jesus came into this world to remove my sin, my pain, my curse on the cross of Calvary. I believe in the death of Jesus. I believe in the resurrection of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for taking my sin, my curse on the cross. I'm a sinner. Say after me, I am a sinner. Please forgive me. I welcome you, Jesus, into my heart, into my life, as my Lord, as my personal Savior. From today, I am a child of God. I'm not afraid of anything. I will not worry about anything because Jesus is inside of me. I believe in the death of Jesus. I believe in the resurrection of Jesus. Holy Spirit is my helper. I love you. I give you thanks. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for using me for your kingdom. In Jesus' name, I agree. And I receive my miracle. I am free in Jesus. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Shalom. Jesus loves you. We love you.